Thanks for checking out the video. If you're new to the channel and you enjoyed the content, please hit like, share, and subscribe. Hello friends and students. Let's study the song, Good Intentions. Okay, I've learned this piece in the meter of 4-4 four, four in the concert key of B flat minor. But as you can see, I've put the capo on at fret 1, and we will refer to all of the chords relative to the capo as if we are in the key of A minor. So let's begin to learn the basic structure of this uh, section of the song. And it's a four measure pattern. Uh, we're going to play A minor, one, two, three, four. Then repeat the A minor, one, two, three, four. The next chord is measure three, F chord, one, two. Notice it only gets two beats. And then E minor chord on beat three and four. Now measure four is the same as measure three. That's the F to the E minor. <clears throat> so that's the basic chords. Let's try that uh, one time. I'll count to four with the basic chords. One, two, three, four. Da, 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 way to jazz up those chords a little. Da, 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 A minor 9. Then F major 7 with a 6. Or, oh, then the E minor 7. Okay, so we can do that. Now let's discuss the arpeggio or the finger picking. So we know in this song there's really not a lot of guitar, so what we're doing is an adaptation for guitar based on the keyboards or the sequences, okay? So now we're going to study the finger picking, which begins with the third finger on the third, on the second string at the third fret letter D. Then play the open first string and the open second string. So we have this little melody D, E, B. Now when you play that, you have to play the uh, bass note on your thumb or on string five, open A, with that. two functions. You have this melodic function, and then you have this bass function. Okay, So that's beat one. Beat two is open third string, and then we have to go to uh, first, the open third string was G, and put the first finger on the second string at the first fret, that's letter C, and then the second finger on the third string at the second fret, letter A. So now we have the first two beats. I'll count to four. Three, four, one, two. Okay, beat three is the same as beat one. Okay, now beat four is open third string G. And then uh, to finish beat four, you have to play G again and then second finger on the third string letter A. So now we have all of the first measure. The second measure is the same. So I'm going to play measure one and two in slow motion. It's all based around the A minor chord. Okay, three, four. play string six with your first finger that's the bass function but at the same time you have to play this melodic function so the melodic function is on string two we already have the D note prepared with our fourth finger then the open E first string and then letter A which is our second finger has that prepared on the third string so we have this little melodic function D E A 
Now can you add your bass with that A, D, A, 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 right? Okay. So then moving on to beat two, is this third finger on fourth string at the third fret letter F. So we have the first two beats of measure three. Okay. Now let's uh, prepare this E minor seven chord. So what I did was just retained my fourth finger. You might call it the pinky, I'll call it the fourth finger. We retained that on fret three of the second string letter D. Now the sixth string is open, our bass note will be E. So the melodic function is D on the second string, open E, open B, which is your second string, so that's D, E, B, but add your bass with that. Okay, and then just three more notes. Open G, third string, then open G, third string again to open second string, B. That gives us all of measure three, which is the F to the E minor. Measure four is the same thing. So I'm going to play just measure three and four in slow motion, counting to four. Three, four. to A minor. So let's put it all together one time. A minor twice, then F to E in measure three, and F to E in measure four. I'll count to four and we'll begin. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, studied the complete first uh, musical background for this piece of music. So if you need to review or uh, learn more of the song, please check the tablature and the sheet music I have provided in this video. So with these items, I hope you will have the tools to study well and have fun.